LMI is only coming to create a, a port. There's a second leg of it. That is creation of what? An industrial park. The government of Ghana is constructing two new ports in an ultra-modern industrial park at Eastern and Savannah region. Before we dive into it, please take a minute and subscribe to this channel for more info on development in the country. The Vice President Dr. Baumia has cut short for the construction of a $200 million debris port project and a thousand acre industrial park worth $250 million by MLI Holding in debris in the central Gonja district in the Savannah region. The $200 million project will involve the construction of two new ports at Akwemu country in the eastern region, that's we are talking of the southern arm of the project, and debris in the Savannah region, which is also the northern arm of the project. The first phase of the project is the rural phase and it will be operational within the first half of next year 2024 and the third project is expected to be fully operational by the year 2025. LMI is only coming to create a, a port. There's a second leg of it. That is creation of what? An industrial park. And this particular one has to do with 29 290 acres of land for this port and the industrial park is going to take 1,000 acres so you are going to have other investors people coming to build hotels some coming to build restaurants some coming to even open private clinics even here the development of this port will combine intermodal operations to ease congestion at the Tema port thus facilitating the transit trade of the country's landlocked neighbors. An extension of the project will be the development of a thousand acre industrial park worth $250 million at Yape with a focus on the development of an agro-processing to add value to agriculture produce. This industrial park which is going to be constructed here signals business readiness and serving production and manufacturing needs for mutual beneficial businesses and industries. The government of Ghana stressed the availability of subsidized services and infrastructures such as road, electricity, energy, water supply and telecommunication services. In the competitive example, attracting international and foreign investors as well as domestic investors. The chief executive of LMI, Mr. Kojo Eduhine, said the Debris Port project includes the development of a logistics part at Debris to capture the greater share of transit trade volume in the sub region. The logistics park will be known as Debris Logistics Terminal. It will be an ultra-modern integrated logistic terminal consisting of a container service yard, container freight station, warehouse, truck parking area, truck services, fuel station, commercial complex, freight forward offices and facilities for the courier such as telecommunication, utility servicing and others. This project will also boost regional trade and value-added manufacturing while reducing road traffic. This new post project will decrease in general transport cost of international transport cargo for importers and exporters from the middle and northern part of Ghana, including the Sahel sub-region, and enhancing export of various products such as cola nut, shea butter, and coffee. Advance the creation of export processing zone in the area, assisting the provision of up-to-date infrastructure to meet current development and technological changes in the shipping industry. The port will also create directly 1,000 to 2,200 direct jobs and over 10,000 indirect jobs in the area and will bring relief to the youth who normally travel far from home to look for non-existing jobs. 
I can tell you for a fact, this project is for the people. It's not for Mr. Kojo Botu Edohine. It's for the people in this area. It's transgenerational. This is a good initiative for the government of Ghana. Thank you for watching. Join the team by subscribing to this channel. Let's promote the country in a positive way. Also, check out our other videos to see other developmental projects that are going on in the country. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.